Hey Scott, uh, welcome back. This is a video in which I'm going to show you how to upload a new video or replace an existing one. So, you know, here we go. Uh, basically, log into your website. Once you're logged in, you'll see the dashboard as usual. Um, next thing you want to do is go to your video page, which is inside the pages category. And sorry if it if this is a little bit slow. It, it's just because of the we're actually live. We're actually making these changes to your website as I am speaking. So you know, you'll go to the video page within your media section, and here's the HTML in question. What we want to do is basically upload a new video and replace this link and make sure we add this class to to the link itself. So, you know, we're going to remove this video first. This link altogether doesn't exist anymore. And we're going to add a new video. I converted the video that you sent me into a MP4 format. So we're going to do that uh, right now. Um, I'm going to navigate to my sample folder, which is here. And here we go. This is the MP4 version of the video that you sent me. The program is going to take uh, some time, so I'm going to pause the video right here and resume when it's done. All right, so that took quite a bit of time, but you know, the the program did its thing, it uploaded the video. The next thing you wanna do is replace the title for this video to reflect whatever you want it to say. So, you know, say for example, you wanted to say, um, grade gig in Toronto 2007. We're gonna insert this into the post and this is the actual URL for the for the file right so what I was saying on my notes is that you may want to save this into a separate location just you know for the sake of um, um, for the sake of maybe changing this later or having to edit the HTML or something so you know make sure you save it into a different file and keep a record um, it, you know, you never know what can happen. So if you ever have to restore it, you know, sometimes it's easier just to replace the reference. Anyways, you know, you have the, the title and you have your URL. We're going to insert it into the post. And now the last thing you want to do is you want to add the class of video to the link. So class video. And then we're going to update the page. So it looks just the same, but if I go into the HTML, I see the class video is applied to this anchor element just before the href. Um, this is going to make it pop up the way uh, it's supposed to. So we're going to go back to the site. And if we go into the media section, you'll see the video is right here.